This is the new Porsche 911. It may look like the old one, but under the skin, it's almost all new. It's got a wider front track, the wheelbase is longer, the engine's got more power, the car's lighter, and the chassis is stiffer. Now, supposedly, this base Carrera S is faster around the Nürburgring than the old 997 Turbo. Uh, I don't have the Nürburgring, I have New Delhi and some bits of the Agra Expressway. Uh, let's see what this baby can do. But, let's take a look at what's really new first, shall we? To the casual observer, this new 911 may not look too different from its predecessor, but it's almost entirely new. The most obvious way to tell this new car from old is to look at the rear. The Porsche badging is a throwback from the Porsches of old, the tail lamps are slimmer and wider, and there are a few other detail changes all over the car. The overall length is 56mm longer than before, the wheelbase has been stretched by 100mm, and a front track that's 46mm wider too. Aluminium has been used extensively in its construction and this helps the new 911 weigh 45 kgs less than its predecessor. On the inside, this 911, like all 911s, has four seats. But while the front seats offer all the space you need, the rear ones are quite cramped and best for seating kids. The engine is a 3.8 litre direct injection flat six as you know, naturally aspirated. But unlike the old 911, this one makes 15 horsepower more. So that's 394 horsepower and uh, 44 point something kgm of torque. It pulls very linearly, so there's no violence when you put your foot down. It's just, it pulls harder and harder and harder. And when it crosses 6,000 RPM, I'll show you. 4,000, fifth gear, yeah, let's go to fourth, five and a half, yeah. Whoa! I hope you can hear that. But it's not all about power. Sports cars need to go around corners well too. And Porsche, masters of traction, have outdone themselves here too. The important thing in a car like this, it's a sports car, right? So your driving position has to be right and it's perfect. I mean, the steering is right there, the gear lever is right here, uh, the seats, fantastic. You've got support right here and good side bolstering. You just get in and feel comfortable in this car. And build quality, it's phenomenal. It's like, uh, I think it's better than some Audis. It's, it's really something else and they've got this nice jewel effect to it. The whole centre console, it really makes it feel, maybe not special, but like a place for serious business. Now the most controversial thing about this new Porsche 911 is that Porsche has gone to an electrically assisted steering system. Now, a lot of people think that it may not be up to the mark, but I've been driving it and I really can't find anything wrong with it. It's direct, it's got more than enough feedback and it's precise. Big 295 section rear tyre. There's hardly any understeer. That's the surprising thing. There's hardly any understeer with this guy. Really, really push hard into corners. It's got Sport and Sport Plus modes and each mode just makes it that much more aggressive in its throttle response, its gear shift violence and its suspension stiffness. As for the ride, it's firm you know, but it's not tiresome, that's the best way to put it. You can feel some of the lumps as you should in a sports car, uh, you need to know what's happening. But it never gets to a point where your spine says, you know, let's go home, I'm tired, I, wanna, I need to lie down. No, never happened. At this point, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to give you a small demonstration about the sound the flat six makes. It sounds like an echo motor, but it's not. It's water cooled, as you know. So I press this little button here that says exhaust. Put the windows down and let's see, let's give it a... Oh. 
This new 911 costs 1.3 crore. And for that price, I can't think of another car that's so much fun, so practical and so friendly to drive. It's, it's what makes this car special, I think. And it's always been like that with 911s. This car just takes it a couple of steps above that. I'm going to have some more fun today. Ta-da!